another year, another day has arrived. Today, the Rainbow Mables and Tracy's crew will become students of Sarsicht. After all, Jody will go there too even though she's in Bailey's crew. But not all troublemakers are bad, since they're older now. However, Mario, Molly, and I make a reservation on the Maples, Tracy's crew, and even Jody. Well, who cares about the reservation? Time to continue on my break. Hey, Sonic, we have some great news. This school is starting tomorrow for all troublemakers to intend it. I just heard about that Mario. What about it? Well Sonic, many kids get invited to participate in the school we are at, since our six started on the first day of school. Exactly Molly, that's why I added Tails and Arbanov to be the teacher towards male students, Amy and Crimson to be the teacher towards female students, and Knuckles and Ella to be part of the gym teacher for all students in PE. Okay. But what kind of subjects do we have in SAR sect? Well Mario, we have seven subjects, there are English, Geometry, Chemistry, French, Digital Art, Japanese, and Korea Ed for you. And what do we have for girls? There are English, Algebra, Biology, French, Drawing Art, Japanese, and Korea for girls. I see. But didn't they get a trip to go to the bathroom just to do their business by using it, or just to get away from school they're attending? Actually, they can't do that. They can only use the bathroom when they're out of their class, and they can leave this place on June 30th once Sasik is over. Right. Okay then assistants, please have our staff bring them to the office immediately. Okay. okay. So yeah Gianna, we need to get Emily, Emma, and Carla there to the Maple Hideout, so that way, me, you, Emily, Emma, and Carla can make out with Jacoby, Isaac, Josh, Rocco, and of course, my handsome guy, Lou. Or should I say, Louisiana. Okay Gif, I like that part of how we're making out each other by doing oral, vaginal, anal, and even mammary one. Good. That's why we girls, make love with our boys around just because we're maples, and we women, have menstrual period around us especially. Absolutely gif. Even though that we're still troublemakers, we did good on our maple team. But anyway, that's enough talking for now. I have to go now. See you later gif. Bye Jonah. Man? I wish Lou could be here but my parents declined me to hang out with him. Maybe I have a message for Lou. Hey Louisiana, your hot and seductive girlfriend will always be there for you. But many people ship us together when Vance would say something about the Louis X. Giffany relationship. And there, he said, Lou gets grounded's creator named Heavenly Steven ships Lou and me together causing Mario to bring it back. That way, our relationship should be Huh. What's this? Oh my god. Not another Sarsic school. I don't want to go. Oh yes you will Jiffany. I just got a message to the Sarsic saying that you are required and invited to Sarsic school. Even though you are not that bad, you are still going to Sarsic since the staff already make a reservation for you and other friends you met. I know this is summertime but get ready for a Sarsic interview. We don't want to be late for it. Okay, Mom. I'm coming. Well, it looks like this is our first time visiting Sarsic. I know, dear, but Gif, Josh, and Emma went to Sarsic last year because Giffany told me about how Sarsic has military and boarding school rules. I'm pretty sure that Sarsic isn't going to be very harsh and longer. I agree with you guys. Good evening everyone, welcome to the new Sarsic interview. I'm Brainiac Adam, and this is Kobe M. Hey you guys. And we're here to inform you that tomorrow is going to be your big day. Some of you guys are saying that this is going to be your worst day in Sarsicht. Well, 
SSJ Mario X05 decided to make Sussex less strict. Exactly, and we don't want anyone to complain that troublemakers don't deserve to be punished harshly at all. Because in Corey Comedia in 1993's channel, Lamar got punished very badly by Lamar's parents, since they're a huge Caillou's parents wannabe. So yeah we don't want Sussex to happen. Do you guys remember him being here in Sarsicht? Yes. I do remember him in Sarsicht and Christmas party. See him here? So do I. Sure you guys do. Well, he's in the Flung Eagles now, so there's no way you can make friends with them, because it's Vance's idea to not make friends with you. But anyway you guys, pay close attention to the Sarsicht interview, because this is going to be your first time visiting there. But some of you guys go there last year and many of you didn't. Well, it's time for us to watch this introduction to see what's going on in there. And remember you guys, stay silent, and enjoy the video. Hello everyone. Welcome to Summer Academy Reformatory School in City for Troublemakers, or Sarsicht for short. The reason for that is we dropped the word Canada, and changed it to City for Fit More in Beyond City for USA, because we live in America and not Canada. But anyway, I'm Sonic the Hedgehog, the principal of Sarsicht. And here are the assistant principals, Mario the Vionda, aka, SSJ Mario X05, and Molly Peterson, aka, Princess Peach X03. Hey you guys. How are you doing? We're so clever to see you. Hi there. We'd like to thank everyone for joining this year Sarsic tomorrow. We'd thought hard to make Sarsic less strict than last year. In addition to the classroom, we added teachers to the group. For example, Miles Tails Prower and Abhin Averov in 2004 will be teachers for boys, and Amelia Rosie the Rascal, or Amy Rose, and Sonny Terra Thomas, a.k.a. Crimson Skull 18 will be teachers for girls. Plus, Knuckles the Echidna and Galaxy Ella the Diamond Heart 792 will be PE teachers for all students and gender. We have three teachers who will be hired in Sarsicht, and three more will be joining in. Together, we have six teachers in total. Now let's move on to the uniform section. Sarsic dress code has the boarding school and private school dress code rule, where everyone has to wear uniform every day, no matter if it's clean or dirty. For boys, they will wear dark blue suit jacket, white collared shirt, red and blue striped tie, dark blue slack, and black dress shoes. Also, they must have black hair. In PE, boys will wear dark blue jacket, white shirt, dark blue track pants, and black sneakers. And in bedtime, boys will wear white shirt and dark blue gym shorts. For girls, they will wear red vest with black buttons, dark blue long collared shirt, red school skirt, white socks, and black heels. Also, they must have blonde hair. In PE, girls will wear red jacket, white shirt, red track skirt, and black sneakers. And in bedtime, girls will wear white shirt and red gym shorts. Let's move on to school supplies. School supplies that are usable for Sussex is papers, notebooks, pencils, crayons, and backpack. Using an electronic devices, such as smartphones, tablets, and hearing objects, such as Bluetooth or wire headphones, and earbuds, and even weapons, such as guns, are prohibited in Sussex. The only electronic devices that isn't prohibited was laptop. You cannot use your laptop for fun though, as Sarsic blocked any site. And we're back. So during Sarsic classes, we need to keep an eye on other student to stay in class. Any excuses will get caught and students will be in ISS. But anyway, we'd like to thank you for joining into our Sarsic interview video. Be ready in tomorrow morning for your big day at Sarsic. And again, Say hello to Mario the Vionda and Molly Peterson as your assistant principals. And I'm Sonic the Hedgehog as your principal of Sarsicht. See you in Sarsicht. And this is us. Signing off.
Goodbye, everyone. Now, do you guys get it what they say in the video? Yes, we, we do get it now. now. Good. Now remember to be on your best behavior in Sussex to your teachers and stuff. Yup. You heard Adam. And don't forget to wake up early at 5 p.m. for your Sussex bus to come. Now you all are free to go. Just so I know, tomorrow is going to be the worst Sarsicht ever. I used to go there for the first time, but later on, I kinda find that school to be the most boring place that I ever went. Man? Going to Sarsicht makes me really traumatizing. If Lou saved me and the other Maples from Sarsicht, then I should give him a really, really big kiss for saving me. Everyone knows there's summer vacation, and I really like to go on a pool or on a beach. This summer holiday is sure as a fun to me. But still. I had no other choice but to go that fucking boarding place that I don't want to go. So I had to go to my bed so that I can wake the hell up and get that son of the bitchy Sarsicht bus to pick me up. Maybe, this PJ fit me a lot better than my previous one. But anyway, I have one more thing to do with Gianna. Okay, what does Giffany want me now? Hello? Who is it? Hey there. It's your bestie Giff here. Hey there Giff. Why are you calling me for? I call you to tell you how are you doing. I'm doing good, but I felt nervous that I'm gonna get stomach cramps during Sarsect. Yeah, same here. That makes you and I get a trip to the bathroom, but the teacher says no. I know. That's unfair. Teachers need to change the rules so make it more lenient than that. So that way, they don't mind if we can do anything we want to. Precisely. But their rules is going to be so cruel and boring as fuck. I agree. And same goes to Jacoby, Isaac, and the other Maples too, including Tracy's crew. What about Jody? Isn't she going to dislike the rules as well? No she ain't. She's is the only Violet's crew to be in. Man, can't this summer holiday going to be perfect? Un un. Not all holidays are perfect excluding Christmas. I do love Christmas though. Me too. Hey Gif, I have an idea. Maybe we can escape by using the fusion dance and then we'll instruct the Maples and Tracy's crew include Jody to leave this shitty place. I'm not sure about that, because they will arrest us and send us to detention. Maybe my handsome guy named Louisiana could save us and the other Maples including the Tracy's crew and Jody. That's no problem to me. Now I can go get some sleep, because I don't want to get tired during the daytime. Same here Jenna. Anyways, I'll see you at the bus. Okay. Good night bestie. You too bestie. Well I understand that tomorrow is going to be a very uninteresting school day, because I thought I was going to get punished by teachers and staff. But I'll make sure if it's harsher or not. But I'll see. Anyways, I have to go to bed right now so peace out. Good night. Man? I'm too nervous that today is the day that I'm going to Sarsicht for a second time. 
and so does my stomach and bladder. This makes me want to use the bathroom to take a huge shit and a long piss, since I have bloating nerves and enuresis about it. I'm gonna miss my parents, and my siblings, and yes. Even my boyfriend Lou. All he wanted me is to make out with him ever since I have stomach cramps and period. But oh well, let me go take a shower and brush my teeth quick. You know what? I already take a shower and brush my teeth, but I kinda scared that I'm gonna be there without Lou. I have to brace myself to face the teachers and to get the Maples, Tracy's crew, and Jody attention to escape Sarsipt for all, and, for real. There? Now that I'm done putting on my clothes, it's time for me to wait for that stupid bus to come. Well, at least playing cards while waiting is not that boring, as long as it isn't an electronic stuff. Let's hope that the bus will come here as soon as possible. <coughs> OMG! The bus is here, I need to come catch up the bus before they're leaving me and my parents is going to ground me for this. Yes? Did you even went to Sarsic last year? Why are you telling me that? Well, you just told Brainiac had a met you, along with Emma and Joshua went there, all because you do remembered Lamar after all those shit he has done in the past 2021 year and earlier of this year. So, do you went there? Yes bestie. It's really awkward and cool that everything in this place sucks very hard. Not even gonna lie. Well Gif. I hope you're gonna be fine in Sarsic. You are my cousin, Janna is your bestie, and we are here to help you out how to escape Sarsic. Thanks Isaac. I really appreciate with you both. But I wish Lou would be there for us. Wow Lou, just wow. That was the best movie that we ever watched for that to go out. I wish dating involves watching movies again soon. I really love you Lou. And thank you for letting me go on a date after escaping mental hospital Lou. You used to see me as your girlfriend back in 2019. And now, you're always my boyfriend. Thank you again Louisiana. You are very welcome Giffany. Um, hey Lou, after we watched some movies at the cinema, What's the gift that you want me to show? Oh, I almost forgot. After we watched movies at the theater, I had this. Would you like to? Marry with me? Because you are the best angelic babe, and the beautiful troublemaking girl in the beyond troublemaking community. And you are the cutest and sweetest girl that I ever seen. So, want to marry me? We will create our own family if we marry. And what's more good stuff? We will have our own kids. A -a 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 -a. Holy heck yes. It's obvious. I want to marry with you. Because you are also the best characters in the ugly dolls. Yes. I want to get married with you. And we will start our own family and having a lot of children for our future life. Let's do a plan for our wedding event. But first, let's kiss are we? Because we're going to marry not at church, but at Beyond High School Auditorium at Friday, April 2nd. Come on Lou, let's kiss. Okay Gif. Let's kiss for our wedding event on Friday. I 
feel like I wanna marry him again. What? Gif, what are you saying? Yeah, cuz, come on, say something. Ah, uh, e, I. I want Lou and myself to be together as a couple. I'm sick and tired of my parents and the ugly dolls always rejected us to hang out with each other. Um, guys? What's going on? Yeah, what happened? Well, Jacoby and Emily, Giffany grows tired of her parents along with the ugly dolls for not letting her and Lou become couples, even though she told me that Vance explained that the original creator did intended to have her and Lou together. Exactly. Right, you guys? Yes, Giff. We believe in you. You can push yourself together now. You're a beautiful and a cute young woman, Giff. You know how to lead us. Rocco is right. You are the prettiest leader of the Maples. Yeah, you are. Thanks, everyone. I'll do my best. But, where is Tracy and her crew? Well, Giffany, they're riding the different bus with Jody even though she's in Vitaly's crew. This is likely due to the fact that buses only have two. So Jody can ride with Tracy's crew, no matter while she's the member of Vitaly's crew. Okay, Emily. That's no problem to me. Good cuz, you are doing better now. Just be brave enough to leave this place. Thanks cuz. I'll do my best. Brace, Brace yourselves, yourselves kids. kids. Because, because we're, we're here, here in Sunset. You kids you will kids be will staying, staying here, here until, until the 30th, 30th of June. June. Now, now, thank you thank for you riding for with us and have, have a good day. day. Hey there, you guys. You must be troublemakers joining the Sarsit. I'm Miles Tails Prower, the male teacher. And I'm Amy Amelia Rose, the female teacher. And we're here to help you succeed your goal to the next level. Now, when I call your name in the alphabetical surname, raise your hand and say here. Okay, here we go. Jacoby Henry Austin. Here. Emily Angela Berger. Here. Carla Hannah Carey. Here. Giffany Bianca Central. Here. Tony Johnny Diaz. Here. Rocco David Gomez. Here. Isaac Roku Hayashi. Here. Gianna Daisy Johnson. Here. Amaravati Kai Madhuvani. Here. And Joshua Lex Michael Perfection. Here. Well, it looks like everyone was here. Follow me to the changing room. Brace, Brace yourselves, yourselves, kids. kids. Because, because we're, we're here in Sarsic, you kids, kids will, be will be staying, staying here, here until, until June 30th. 30th. Now, now thank, thank you for riding, you for riding with, us with us and have, and a, have good a good day. day. Good morning, everyone. This will be your first time visiting there in Sarsic. My name is Sonny Sarah Thomas, aka Crimson Skull 18, the female teacher. And I'm Abhinav Aravine, 2004, the male teacher. Today is your great day that I am working with Miles Prower as a co-teacher for boys, and Crimson is working with Amy Rose as a co-teacher for girls. Now, when I call your name in alphabetical surname, raise your hand and say here. Now, let's get to it. Jody Cantrell. Here. Robert Donerson Jr. Here. Melody Gray. Here. Jackson Hingleston. Here. Jayla Hingleston. Here. Lauren McCormick. Here. Victor McCreary. Here. Robbie Morgan. Here. Carrie Newman. Here. Maria Sokolov. Here. Tracy Tylerson. Here. Grace Marie Williams. Here. Ace Wong. Here. And last, but not least, Bertram Zager. Here. That's all for everyone. But anyway you guys, Principal Sonic the Hedgehog is waiting for you guys and the other troublemakers to be in the Auditorium Center. Don't just stand there. 
follow us to the changing room. Now come on, let's go right now. Oh man. I'm getting too nervous about Sarsic uniform. It looks like that I'm going to the boarding school. Actually Lauren, Sarsic is a private boarding school. So we're getting used to it, but that's very pitiful. Exactly. Well we don't have any choice. Let's put it on right now to see if it really fit us. And hope that we can be smiled enough in order to escape the Sarsic building. Well you girls, the outfit looks like it is the uniform one. Don't you think? Yes, Gif. It looks like it. But, are we going to do the rest of it? Of course we're going to Lauren. Let's put it on quickly before we're running late right away. Well girls, I think my uniform fits me very well. Mine's two. And mine's three. Well, it looks like our dressing is done. Let's go outside for the other girls who wanted to see us how we dress. Sure. sure. Hey Giffany and Chandler. You're back. Where's Lauren? Just so you know Zero, Lauren's left to see where she was before, meaning that she's with Tracy's crew. I see. Well you see, we're waiting for the announcement that it is time for us to change our hair colors, and then be sent to the auditorium. I know Emma. This is going to be my first time seeing the principal in this boarding place. Don't worry Gianna, everything is going to get changed for good in a while. You are exactly right Jacoby. Attention, Attention all, all students, students please, please report, report to the hair color changing, changing room for your hair to change, change and, and then, then go straight, straight to the auditorium room, room for your sarsic orientation. orientation. Well guys, this is it. We need to get to the hair color changing room, and then the auditorium room as soon as possible. Right! Okay then. Let's go right now. Good morning, everyone. I'm Ms. Peterson, your Vice Principal here. And welcome to your new school, Summer Academy Reformatory School in City for Troublemakers, or Sarsic for short. Today is your big day for you guys for being here at Sarsic. Your principal named Sonic the Hedgehog will be waiting for you guys at the auditorium. So when I call your surname in alphabetical order, stay here and get up to change your hair color. Ready? Let's, Let's begin. begin. Jacoby Henry Austin. Here. Emily Angela Berger. Here. Joey Cantrell. Here. Carl Hannah Carey. Here. Give me Bianca Central. Here. Tony John Diaz. Here. Robert Donison Jr. Here. Rocco David Gomez. Here. Melody Gray. Here. Isaac Roku Hayashi. Here. Jackson Heen Leston. Here. Jayla Heen Leston. Here. John Daisy Johnson. Here. Amarvati Haim Adamity. Here. 
Lauren McCormick. Here. Victor McCreary. Here. Robbie Morgan. Here. Carrie Newman. Here. Joshua S. Michael Perfection. Here. Maria Sokolov. Here. Tracy Tylerson. Here. Grace Murray Williams. Here. Ace Wong. Here. And finally, Bertram Zaker. Here.
Um, guys. What is going to happen now? Is the principal going to be here? I really don't know Gif, but he's going to be here anytime soon. I agree with Isaac. When Sonic comes, he's going to discuss everything to us about our Sarsicht orientation. To be honest Gianna, he's going to inform us which classroom are we going to. Yeah, but this is going- Attention all students. Thank, Thank you guys, guys for being patient. patient. Now, without, without further ado, ado, please welcome to your Sarsic principal, Sonic the Hedgehog. Greetings everyone. Why hello there. How are you students doing? I'm Sonic the Hedgehog, and I will be your principal this year. After the former principal of Sussex was killed by an arson, Mario, my friends, and I rebuilt this building to make it bigger. Since you guys are all troublemakers who didn't have enough credit, we have seven subjects for you. Okay. Now everyone, recite your pledge to Sussex that you will be on your good behavior this month. Our career and courage. You guys are right. And for viewers who don't understand what students are saying, they said, we're students of the private boarding school of Summer Academy Reformatory School in City for Troublemakers, and we promise to the school that we're attending, and to the State of Republic about how our life is, for which it makes sense. For nation of either USA, Canada, Europe, Japan, UK, etc. under our former principle, with freedom and pride or no freedom and pride for our career and courage. Now, are you ready for you guys for your classroom even though that this is sex segregated for you? Shall we begin this? Yes! yes. All right then. And once again viewers, they said, yes, we shall begin this. But anyway, you guys are free to go. Take care and have a great Sussex day. Well Emily and Jacoby, I think this is going to be our great time visiting Sussex initially. Exactly. You guys should go to male classroom while I go to the female classroom. And let's make sure that teachers don't make strict rules like the previous ones did. But Isaac and I need to go right now. Agreed with him. Okay, so take care sweetie bae. You too Isaac and Jacoby. I'll see you guys next time. I want you guys to be safe when you're in the classroom. Now I have to go now. Okay, that's enough. Come on Zero, let's go to the classroom immediately. Aren't you girls excited for your new classroom to start? Of course. Emma and I will be going to the females classroom, and Josh, Tony, and even yourself will be going to the males. We're sure that we'll be okay Rocco. You take care of yourselves, isn't that right Joshua and Tony? That is totes right Emma. Even though we are good troublemakers in the Rainbow Maples, we still be sex segregated in many different classroom. And once Giffany told us on the bus saying that Lou is, and always be her boyfriend. She wants herself and Louis to be together forever and even get married soon. Tony, I get that. But anyway Carla and Emma, we'll see you next time on the cafeteria. You too you guys. I hope that you guys will see us again. Would you guys mind the Temer and I can do the same thing as you guys did? Well, sure then. Let's kiss, shall we? We're looking forward to see you again. Take care of yourself. Come on Carla, let's go to the female classroom now. Okay. Hey Tony, are you ready along with Rocco and I to go to the male classroom? Absolutely. 
I thought the current principle of Sarsicht is strict, but it turns out that he was more clement than the former ones. But anyway you guys, let's go immediately. Right. right. Well girls, it's look like this is it. This will be you girls first time being here in Sarsicht while this is my second time being here. Exactly. Lauren and I never been on Summer Academy Reformatory School in City for Troublemakers before. I know that we're still troublemakers, but people need to be nice to us, because there's criticism going on to make the on community more safer than that. Yup. But let's hope that our teacher will be nicer to us than the previous one, because I was nervous that she's going to kill me. Well, no need to worry girls, I'm still beautiful and seductively like you girls are. Very well. Yeah, yeah. And I really hope that Jacoby can still be with you Gianna, but I thought you was going to date Kenward Lauren, but Connor didn't say that Crimson got permission to do that. And I wish that Luke can still be with me, so we can be together and get married forever. You know what? That's enough talking for now. Let's go to the female classroom right here, and right now. Okay. okay. Well guys, this is it. Our first attending in Sarsicht. All right. As you wish, with that happened, we waiting for our introduced teacher to come in. Hello there boys. You do remember us outside at the parking lot. Once again, I'm Miles Tails Prower and this is my co-teacher, Abhinav Aravine 2004. Well, you can call us as Mr. Prower and Mr. Aravind. And we're here to teach you guys in male classroom. For subjects, we're gonna do English for first period, geometry for second period, chemistry for third period, French for fourth period, digital art for fifth period, Japanese for sixth period, and career ed for seventh period. Well to make it even more okay, we're more kind to you all as opposed to the previous guy named Mr. Daniel who's always very harsh on other boys to catch up and improve their grades and behavior. So guys, who went to Sarsic 2021 last year with Mr. Daniel? I am. Because I'm the exclusively student who sees him in person along with Lou, Raven, Kenwood, Lama, and Dylan. Okay, we understand that. But anyways you guys, by Friday we'll be handing out your laptops just for an educational purposes only. By lunchtime, an uneducational website will be unblocked for you guys to enjoy during lunchtime, but when the bell ring, it'll be blocked again, and you guys will be straight to class. Mr. Prower is right. But anyways, this is our first period class, so you guys will be start doing English work. Now take out your notebooks and your pencil and let the class begin. Oh wow. Can you believe this? This classroom looks different than the other ones. I know right Giffany. Let's hope that our introduced teacher should be arrived soon. Hi, there. You girls must be newcomers in Sarsicht. We know that you do remember us in a parking lot. But let me say this again, I'm Amy Amelia Rose and my co-teacher name is Crimson Skull 18. And if you want, you can call us Ms. Rose and Ms. 18. Yeah, and to any of you why I'm Ms. 18, it's because I wanted to be named after Android 18 from Dragon Ball Z. Also, we're here to you in the female classroom. Now for subjects, we have English for period 1, Algebra for period 2, Biology for period 3, French for period 4, Drawing Art for period 5, Japanese for period 6, and career ed for period 7. But anyways, I know that the previous teacher named Sergeant Emma who teaches girls in Sarsicht were very severe to all girls in classroom. Well, not to worry, we're very kind to you all so we'll make your grades and behavior good as possible. Now, can anyone tell me who went to Sarsicht last year? Well Ms. Rose, Emma and I did. We went to that previous one along with two female Violese crew member named Rebecca and Eloise. 
and even we try to be part of Wiley's crew, the Blue Angel dude told Ms. 18, and Mario that Andrew and Gabe don't want me and Giffany to be part of Wiley's crew. We have no choice but to go to Tracy's crew, but luckily, we made our own crew called the Rainbow Maples. Oh, I see. Well by the way, we're bringing you laptops for you girls to use, but it's for an educational purposes only. You can go on any uneducational website if you want, since it's unblocked, but only for lunchtime. And it'll be blocked due to bell ringing and it's back to class for you girls. I agree with Ms. Rose. Regardless, let's start with period 1 in English class. So have your notebooks ready and let's begin. Okay, Emily, since you're Canadian descent who's from Quebec, but lives in USA, you can start reading this language since you're fluent in French. Okay, Miss Rose, I'll read in French to any girls who wants to listen to me speaking in French. That's good to hear. Now read what it says. All right. Here goes nothing. Nous sommes des élèves du pensionnat privé de la Summe Academy Reformator Ishol à City Fort Trouble Maquet, et nous promettons à l'école que nous fréquentons. Et à l'état de république sur ce qu'est notre vie, pour laquelle elle a du sein. Pour les nations des États-Unis, du Canada, de l'Europe, du Japon, du Royaume-Uni, et que trace ou notre ancien directeur, avec liberté et fierté, ou pas de liberté et de fierté pour notre carrière et notre courage. Alors, comment dois-je faire? Oh my goodness! You are the best Canadian French speaker that none of any troublemaking girls ever flew into that. Wow. Thanks ma'am. You both mean a lot to myself even more than that severe bitchy teacher. Um, excuse me? You do not ever say that kind of language in every school. But you are very welcome. You can now sit down. Okay. Sorry about that. That's okay. It's an accident. Now please be seated. All right girls, it's lunchtime. Looks like you are now dismissed to cafeteria. See you later. I can't believe they're not serving anything disgusting like lumpy potatoes. Unlike military or boarding school, and the previous Sarsic ones, they're now serving hot dogs, burgers, pizza, pasta, chicken, and much more. I know right Jana. Lumpy potatoes have no effects on people's health to make them grow tougher. Not everyone can do that in real life. I even watched Cory Comedian 1993's Lamar video where his parents says this. And while you are grounded, you'll be eating absolutely nothing but lumpy potatoes for every meal including dessert. And once Lamar goes upstairs to his room crying in Ludovico voice, he says this again. And if you don't stop crying like an older car, I'll turn you into one and have you sold into Vance's game show. Oh my gosh. Why would they even do that? This thing has finally been stopped by the Blue Angel dude, who thinks that is annoying, when in fact it's really hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> well, to be honest you guys. Many people have stopped doing the lumpy potatoes in the motor car thing. Because it's making everyone including the Blue Angel dude annoying as hell. I understand that potatoes are used to make people healthy not to force people to eat it as a punishment food. Well, Lamar's now with his uncle, his aunt, and his cousins. So after his parents got arrested for giving him a punishment day on his 18th birthday, their last word to him is this. Young man, we are going to get you for this. One day you will definitely have to pay the full price. That's good to hear Gianna. And that's why Corey made the important criticism about why people should stop making punishment day videos, 
and why they should stop making other viewers upset about the abusive content they made. Well, he also made the post saying to troublemakers happy birthday to whoever it is, even though that they're still a troublemaker, after seeing Vance's post saying that unhappy birthday is getting old nowadays. Man. Corey's video is so funny. I agree. Now let's stop talking about that Corey video and enjoyed our lunch. Okay. okay. Welcome back gentlemen. Our next period is the fifth one. And this one is called digital art. We hope you guys will fought hard on the computer like art technique, because we want you all to be in your success. Now let's get going. Well 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 Isaac, it looks like you're the cousin of Giffany, who's both races and nationally are Asian, Japanese, and Filipino. It's time for you to do your part and read it in Japanese letter, since we taught you to be fluent to the Japanese language. Fine then. If that's what you want from you two and other male students, then I'll take chances, get ready, and read what it says on the board. Now that's the spirit Isaac. Now do what we told you to do. Alright then. Here it is. 私たちは、トラブルメーカーのための都市のサマーアカデミー改革派学校の私たちが通っている学校に約束します。そして、私たちの生活がどのようであるかについて、共和国の状態に、それは理にかなっています。私たちの前の校長の下で、米国、カナダ
Wow, Jacoby, it's been the first time that you have been fluent to Japanese. Um, okay, but why is that? Well, that's because you and your cousin Giffany are both Asians due to being as both Japanese and Filipinos. That's why your teacher wants you two to read the Japanese Ramaji writing on the board. Well, don't sweat it. I'm not gonna make you speak Japanese, I only want an English speaking and the American born and lived person and like you and your cousin. You mean you're gonna keep us, including GIF, a secret? Of course I will. Wow. Thanks, Jacoby. No problem. Okay, okay gentlemen. gentlemen. It's, it's bedtime, bedtime for you. Now, now go, go to sleep and I'll, I'll see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Okay. okay. Good, Good night. night. OMG Gianna. Lauren and I guess that your Japanese voice is way talented. We also guess that your Japanese Filipino American leader of the Rainbow Maples after all. I agree with Jonah. Why thank you girls. You both mean a lot to me. But I just want to know why it's impossible to treat us like we're worse than Hitler. Allow me to explain GIF. When we first arrived at Sarsicht, the only machine are meant to change hair colors, and the staff gave us plenty of uniforms for us to wear, instead of going to the machine to get clothes from it. And once Principal Sonic arrived at the stage, they gave us orientated information why SAR-6 should become lenient, whereas the previous ones be home strict, and why they should treat everyone including troublemakers like they are equal. And like what Martin Luther King says, darkness cannot drive out darkness. Only light can do that. Hate cannot drive out hate. Only love can do that. Wow. Not only that you are a lifesaver Lauren, but you're my new bestie as well. I guess that even though that you don't get a boyfriend, I Giffany, Gianna, and you Lauren will always be best friends forever. Indeed. Okay, okay ladies. It's, it's bedtime, bedtime for you. you. Now, now go, go to sleep, sleep and I'll, I'll see you tomorrow. tomorrow. Okay. Good, Good night. night. My life is in your hands. I will be there for you, Lou. Attention all students of Sarsicht, please report to the cafeteria to have your breakfast ready, and then change it to a PE uniform. Wow. Did you hear that, girls? Yeah, it sounded like Principal Sonic on the intercom talking to us to go to the cafeteria. We better go right now before we're gonna be late. So, who's with me? We, we are. are. Well good morning everyone. You're just in time. Our staff had cooked many breakfasts for all of you. Well, don't just stand there, just grab anything, and choose any seat you want. But make sure you have to be fast so that you change your pajamas into PE uniform. Coach Knuckles and Coach Ello will be waiting for you in the gym. All right, Giffany, are we ready to see Coach Knuckles and Coach Ella and Sarsicht for the first time? I bet I am. We're going to act seriously, and I mean, really seriously to the coach. You got that right. Let's go then. Right? Right. So let's start. Good morning, fellows. Looks like you're for another training lesson. Agreed with Knuckles. Now, are you ready for some challenging experiences? Yes! 
Yes. Good. Now let's get on with the lesson. And remember you guys to be on your best behavior and success. Okay then. Follow us to the track field so we can get started on our continuous challenging lesson. Can you see what we did Isaac? We challenged difficult training to help us surpass. I know that cuz. It's really a hard work. Precisely. I'm pretty sure that my boyfriend Lou, and your girlfriend Emily, will be here for us. Um, okay. But why? Did you remember when you, Emily, Lou, and I went to Valentine's Day party? It's really amazing. Oh, I do remember that. Well. You better remember that. Anyways, let's go to the principal's office. Okay, that's good to hear. Let's go. With Principal Sonic is gone somewhere else, it's time for me to call my boyfriend, Louis Perfection. Oh boy, Lou is gonna save us for real this time. And I guess that he loves our crew you created. And look. Sonic has his phone app on his office computer too. Maybe I'll call my boyfriend if he wants to talk to me. Man. I'm really bored right now. I miss my pretty girlfriend Giffany, and now that I heard that she's in Sarsic. This is by far the most boring month I had. Huh? Who's this? Hey, is that Sonic? Go away. Arg. What does he want now? Hello? Hey Louisiana, did you remember me? It's your sexy babe. G.I.F. here. Giffany? Is that you? Of course it was me. I'm using Sonic's office computer as a phone so I'm glad that you can talk to me. Wow. I miss you Giff. Ah, I miss you too. Oh, and by the way, my cousin wants to talk to you. Hey there. It's me, Isaac. Hey Isaac. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. We want you to be here, so you can lead us how to escape Sasik for real this time. Really? I can't go there myself. Well, you're just gonna call one of the remaining Tracy's crew member, and your friends to help you out. They'll know how to get there. You mean Raven, Rebecca, Kenward, and Eloise? What about Jody? She's the only Violet's crew member who attends Sarsikt. Okay, but what are the remaining Tracy's crew members' name? Jordan Vollmer, Tabitha Norton, and Johnny Verma. Wait. So they're named Jordan, Tabitha, and Johnny? Are they members of Tracy's crew? Yes they are. You need to get your friends to help out how to save us. So that way, we can be free from Sarsikt. Sounds good to me. I love you Gif. I love you too Lou, to the moon and back. Now we have to go now. See you See when, you, you, get when there. you get there. No problem. You know what? I'm getting tired of having a beard and a mustache. 
It's time for me to shave it all off. Okay, now that I'm back to my old self again, let's call Raven, Rebecca, Kenward, Eloise, and whoever Jordan, Tabitha, and Johnny are, to see if they could help me save Giffany and his cousin Isaac. I wonder how Giffany, Gianna, and Zero are doing. They've been in Sarsic for almost a month. And they still didn't text me, call me, send me gifts, nothing at all. Well Raven and the others, wherever you are, you guys better hurry fast. Oh wow. It must be them. I'll go get the door quickly before the ugly dolls see this. Hey there Lou. How's it been there? It's been good lately. Did you call us to tell that we're gonna save them? Who are they? I don't know. Giffany would tell us when we're there. Okay Lou, we understand. Isn't that right everyone? Yes it is. Sure. Of course. I know that. Precisely. Very well then. Alright then. Let's activate two buses to see which one it would be. Lewis, I just found out that Giffany sent to me. Huh? What is it, Rebecca? I just saw a community post on SSJ Mario X05's community post saying that it is revealed that he made a group called the Rainbow Maples. What did you say? The Rainbow Maples? Incredible. I thought Giffany, Emma, and Josh would stick up to Tracy's crew. But man, Rainbow Maples? Who are the Rainbow Maples? Well allow me to explain. The crew name of the Maples, are identified as Giffany Central, Gianna Johnson, Jacoby Austin, Isaac Hayashi, Emily Berger, Amaravati Madhuindi, Joshua Perfection, Tony Diaz, Rocco Gomez, and Carla Carey. I know who Gianna, Emma, Joshua, Giffany, and her cousin Isaac is. But who's Jacoby, Emily, Rocco, and Carla? I don't know. What should we do to know them? Maybe we'll think about it. What's up you guys? You with a black suit must be Louie Perfection from Ugly Dolls. My name is Brianna, and this is Tiana and Iana. Hi there. Oh, hey there girls. Well, this is the remaining Viley's crew named Raven, Rebecca, Kenward and Eloise, and this is the remaining of Tracy's crew named Jordan, Tabitha, and Johnny. So tell us, who created the girls? You know Raven, a user named Q Princess Procure Fan 9000 created us to be the member of the Molly gang. And as you see, Molly betrayed us and moves on, improving her behavior for real. We're up against that entitled Karen's crew. Who are they? Dish girls. Nah. -ah. They're called Cheer Girls created by the same person who created us. Wait a second. What happened to them? Many people started to be lovers of the Cheer Girls back in 2020 and 2021, and they become hatred of them in this year, 2022. And from now on, we're starting to improve our behavior for real. But where's Carla? Yuna, I hate to say this, but Carla is in another crew called the Rainbow Maples, and she's in Summer Academy Reformatory School in Canada oops. I mean, City for Troublemakers, or Sarsic for short. What? Are you fucking serious Raven? Rainbow Maples? 
Yup. He's right. And Tracy's crew as well. That's why I want you Brianna, Tiana, and Yuna to help us rescue the Rainbow Maples and Tracy's crew to bail out of Sarsicht. Can you tell us what's the Tracy's crew member's name? I'll tell you, Tracy Tylerson, Robert Donison Jr., Victor McCreary, Robbie Morgan, Melody Gray, Lauren McCormick, Ace Wong, Jayla Hingleston, Jackson Hingleston, Maria Sokolov, Bertram Zager, Carrie Newman, and Grace Marie Williams. They're the members of Tracy's crew. And here's the fun fact. Lou, Raven, Rebecca, Kenwood and I went to Sarsic last year with Giffany, Amaravati, and Joshua who's in the Rainbow Maples, and Lamar and Dylan who's in the Flying Eagles. Sadly, Flying Eagles cannot be friends with us since SSJ Mario X05 found out that Vance said so. I understand that. Awesome. Now are you guys ready to save the Rainbow Maples and Tracy's crew from Sarsic? Yes! Okay then. It's time for teamwork then. Here we go! go. Alright, so Rebecca and Brianna will find clothes for the Rainbow Maples, and Raven, Tiana and I will go save them from their classes. While Tabitha, Johnny and Yuna will find clothes for Tracy's crew, you Kenward, Eloise, and Jordan, go save them. Right! Man? Gianna? Zero? What's taking them so long? I have no idea. Maybe we'll rest in the locker until they come. Right, Isaac? Yes. Huh? Hold on. I hear someone coming. Gianna. Isaac? Stay paying attention. Okay. Hey there you guys. How is it going? O-M-G? Lou, I knew that you could come in. Giffany, you're okay. Wow. What's up Lou? You're still okay. Giffany has told me and Isaac all about you. Isn't that true, Isaac? It's what you're thinking, Giff. We're so glad that you came here non-stoply. Now let's find Jacoby, Emily, Emma, Joshua, Tony, Rocco, and Carla. Actually, Carla is in my side right now. Huh? What do you mean your side? Didn't you realize? A username cute princess precure fan 9000 created us in making our own group called Molly Gang. Isn't she a student of Sarsicht? Yes, she was. Also, did you remember Molly? Well, she's also the assistant principal of Sarsicht. What? Are you freaking kidding me right now? I'm dead serious right now. Why the fuck did you arrive at Sarsicht for? It's because we're finally improving our behavior in the end community, since we're no longer bad people. Um? Okay. Never mind that. Now everyone. Let's find the remainder of Sarsicht and let's turn you guys back to why you guys were. Okay. Alright guys, tomorrow is going to be our last day of Sarsic school. So who's with me if we want to go home and have some fun? I do. I do too. And I do three. Ha! Huh? It's that a teacher? Hold on, please show yourself to see who you are. Whoa! Isaac! I'm glad you came out freely, but who are these two guys? Well boys, you already know my cousin's boyfriend. Lewis Prototype Perfection. But I would like to meet this guy with grey jacket. His name is Raven Jerome Edward Fernandez. Hello, Hello there. there. Luke Raven. 
I knew that you guys came here to rescue not only me, but other guys as well. Oh. Well I guess this is going to be our last day of Sarsic school, huh? You are totally right Tony. This is going to be the blast of it. I'm sure it'll be. I know who Joshua is, but who are these Sarsic male student? Well, their names are Jacoby Austin, Tony Diaz, and Rocco Gomez. Okay, we understand that. Alright boys, it's time to get out of this immediately before any staff of Sarsic are coming. Okay. okay. Man! When will Giffany learn that why isn't she there after P.E.? I wish I wanna go home and spend this fun summertime. Me too. And me three. Qui est cette personne? Um, I have no idea, who could this be? Let's find out who it is. Oh. Giffany, Jenna, you're here. But, who is exactly do you think that girl with green shirt is? Girls, do you want to know who that girl with green shirt is? Her name is Tiana, but I really don't know what her surname is. Hi. Oh, hey Tiana. Who created you? Allow me to explain. Tiana was created by cute princess Precure Fan 9000 along with Carla to create the Molly Gang. Wait! Diana! Carla! You came! I miss you! I miss you too! <sighs> you know what Tiana? Carla's all yours! Girls, do you have any idea why she's in the Rainbow Maples? Okay. Listen to me, and you ladies self. When people starting to don't care about Carla, Mario has an idea to add Carla into our Rainbow Maples group. He also shipped that bad boy named Rocco Gomez and Carla herself as a couple, and Tony called me and Gift to bring them to the Maple community, causing her to get her boredom out. And when all of a sudden, he saw a user named Azure Midnight Gemstone due to UK3's community post, along with Galaxy Ella the Diamond Heart 792 saying that the Molly Gang, which includes you and Carla, to improve their behavior, thus, making them become a very nice gang. Wow! I can't believe you're telling me the truth in the first place! Wanna try this bump? Sure? I hope Carla and I can see you girls again, whenever you girls calling me and are for help, and for fun. Thanks. Now girls, are you ready get the hell out of this school for real? Yeah. yeah! Good, now let's fucking do it. Huh? I heard footsteps coming in our way. Guys, who's that? Oh, I see. It must Kenward and Eloise that I met before. Did you remember him dating you? Oh yeah, I used to do that to him, and we stopped dating each other after Vance made a video about our relationship and how people should stop adding troublemakers into Vali's crew, causing the original user's hard work to be unobliterated. We understand that ad. Finally, I found you guys there. Where have you been? Yeah, tell us. We want to hear you in full sentences. Oh. Our parents registered us to go to Sarsikt all because we are troublemaker. And I didn't get to be there ever since I pour poison into the principal's lunch, making her very sick and getting poisoned. Well, that's okay Jody. Says the one that I was dating Lauren right here back in September through December of last year. What did you just say Kenward? I was wondering. If you would've. Um. Reunited with me as a couple and married each other as a spouse. What? 
Many, Many of you have been following up with this and telling us about the ship. ship. And, and I, I need, need to come out and say this before it's too late. late. Lauren N. Kenward R. Not, not dating. Not, not dating. Not, not dating. Jeez, Kenward. I won't. I refuse to fucking date you and married with you, and I command you to stop fucking saying that. You know that Vance Productions is gonna mad at us as J Mario X05 and Crimson Skull 18 if they made us reunited as a couple again. You know what? I'm very sorry Lauren for dating you without my owner's permission, and I won't do that again in my future life. Forget what I said in the past. It's okay. I forgive you. Everybody makes mistakes sometimes. Don't feel so down Kenward, I'm not mad at you. I just want you to be your own yourself to your own original creator. Thanks Lauren. No problem Kenward. But you guys need to rescue Tracy, Robert, Victor, Robbie, Melody, Jayla, Jackson, Maria, Bertram, Carrie, and Grace Marie. They're members of the Tracy's crew, and we need you guys help to save them. Am I making myself clear? Yes. yes. Good. Now let's go. All right, we're back. Now let's go change you back to normal for you guys. Who's excited? We yeah. are. Good then. On to the changing room we go. All right, guys, stand back. Okay Maples, are you ready to change that Sarsic hair color back into your own one? Yes! Alright then. Close your eyes. Okay sweetie, our eyes have been shut. Good babe, now please keep your eyes closed. Well Maples, are you ready to turn Sarsic's hair color back into your own one? Good. Ready? One, two, three. All right, you can open your eyes now. Huh? Nothing happened. Maybe I'll go check on everyone. OMG everyone, your hair color is back. So does yours. Wow Lou. Our hair color is back. Thanks for your help. No problem Gip. I'm always there for you. And same words for you Gianna, Isaac, Jacoby, Emily, Emma. Joshua, Tony, Rocco, and Carla, you guys are awesome. But before you guys go, Brianna and Rebecca will have any words from you. Okay guys, we're ready for you to get your own clothes back. Follow us to the changing room so we can go back home to have some summer fun. Well Gianna, this is it. It's our lucky day. It sure is. Now let's put our own clothes back on. Right. Alright. Our clothes are back to normal now. But it needs one more thing for us to wear on the top of the head. And that is your tiara and my ribbon. We should go get it now. Yeah. Um, Gianna. Why are you wearing my ribbon? And why are you wearing my tiara? Let's try this again by trading this. Fine. 
Let's try this again. Now that's better. What are we waiting for GIF? Let's go meet them outside. Okay Gianna. Let's go then. I hope Giffany and John are going to be okay. They will Emily. We hope that they'll come. Hey guys. Did you all miss us? Sure, we did. Now everything is back to normal now. We can go home very soon when the time is right. Before you guys go, we need to talk about Carla. Okay everyone. This is going to be a long conservation that was taken to the staff of Sarsic School. And remember to use your listening ears if you want to know the full truth about Carla and why she's coming back to the Molly Gang. Shall we say this? So, let's say this full truth about her. Cute Princess Precure Fan 9000 is the owner of Carla, Brianna, Tiana, Yuna, and Molly to create one of their own crew called the Molly Gang. I know they were troublemakers in 2020 to 2021, and Molly became nice person first, and Carla, Brianna, Tiana, and Yuna became nice people then. Throughout March to July, many people started to don't care about Carla, Brianna, Tiana, and Ina anymore. Carla may have become the Rainbow Maples and Rocco's boyfriend by then, but now, a few moments earlier. They now like them again. What? Are you serious? Yes, we are serious. Now we need you guys to wait outside while we're taking Carla to the office to talk to the staff about how our life as a troublemaker is and how users need to have more respect toward us. Is that clear? And that's the story of how our life is, and how we make our life interested and easier. Wow. I'm glad you told us a story about how you guys' life is. Isn't that, right? Yay. I agree. I agree too. I agree 3. I agree 4. I agree 5. And I agree 6. Well, that's good to hear. You know what Carla, Brianna, and Tiana? We can now reunite the Molly gang. Really? Thanks. It's meant a lot to Brianna, Carla, and I. You should make an announcement to Tracy's crew too, and make sure that Ina knows about that, Sonic. Can you do that? Of course. You guys are dismissed. Okay. okay. Okay you guys, back off. Ready to change your hair color back to normal everyone? Yes! Okay. Now shut your eyes and get ready for a magician. Ready guys. Okay then. Here we go. One, two, three. You can now open your eyes. Oh well. Our hair has changed back to normal. Thank you so much. No problem, Lauren. Oh, and Tabitha, Johnny, and Yuna have something to say for you. Hey there, you guys, hope you all are happy to get your hair colors back. Now it's time for you guys to go to the changing room to get your clothes back. Now don't just stand there. Let's go to the changing room right away. 
You know. It going to be my last day as well as I know. I well as am I going to change it back to my own clothes. Well what am I waiting for, let me put it on right away. Normally, I would get my shoes, but these long boots fit me very well, and hot like how hot girls do wear. Because boots are made for walking. Lauren, are you there? Come out. Okay. I'm coming. Looks like you're back to normal you guys. It's now time to get... Attention all students of Sussex, it has come to my attention that you students are officially dismissed from Summer Academy Reformatory School in City for Troublemakers. Lou has told us why we should treat troublemakers fairly like good people. And you know, Molly has something to say to you. You know, this is me, Molly Peterson. I just want to let you know that Carla, Brianna, Tiana, and I are right about you and ourselves. Maybe you can reunite with us with the Molly gang, so our behavior is improved, and forever, it will be. Back to you, Sonic. Thanks, Molly. Now, on to the attention. Students of Sussex, we changed our mind about tomorrow is your last day of Sussex. So, it'll be your last day of Sussex today. We'd like to thank you for joining Sussex this month. That'll be all you guys. You are dismissed. And this is Principal Sonic, signing off. Oh, my, freaking, boy. This is you guys. It's time to go home. The coast is clear. Tails, Amy, Knuckles, Crimson, Arbanov, and Ella already left home. And this November and December, we're going to do new school. It's called, Winter Academy Reformatory School in Christmas for Troublemakers. Or Warsicked for short. It's not going to be a boarding school, but the military school instead. Wow. Wow is right. Now it's time for us to clean this place up. Now everyone, follow me. Okay. Well Molly, our career as an assistant principal is over. Yup. Looks like our job here is done. All right, but I can tell you one last question. Go on. Say it. I love you very much, and I'd love you to be my girlfriend. What do you say? Really? Absolutely. I would love to be your girlfriend. Cool. Let's make out then. Yeah. Mario? Mario? Molly? Molly? Are you, are there? you there? Come, come here right this instant. instant. It's, it's time, time to clean, clean up. up. Okay, Sonic. We will. Aren't we? Yes, Molly dear. Let's go right now. Tee hee. Well, sure. Well you guys, I think this is our best day ever in our life. I'm taking Lou with me to hang out, just not to become the Maples member though. It's fine with us Giffany. And look, Carla is now with Brianna, Tiana, and Una. Listen Rocco, you and Carla will be breaking up. But Crimson Skull 18 will help you find your new girlfriend in the process. Thanks Raven. You're the best. No problem. Alright. Now it's time for Viley's crew. The Rainbow Maples. Tracy's crew. And the Molly Gang. To depart each other. Actually, Yulu, Jacoby, Chandler, Emily, Giffany and I wanted to stay here for a while since we have Jacoby's car, Emily's car, and Lewis's car due to Beyond Logic. Oh right. Now it's time to leave now. 
You may all go now. Okay, then. Good Goodbye. You too. You know guys, we have so much fun at Sarsit, but I wish I wanted to do the beach and a pool too. As a matter of fact, I just want to do other things that I need to do. Yeah, me too. I agree with them. So do I. We'll just call a taxi to come to pick us up and have money for it due to buy and logic. You six are good to go. Okay. Just so you know you guys. Cela se produit parce que les membres de la communauté Vian ont été si toxiques au cours des deux à trois dernières années, et cela devient incontrôlable pour tout le monde en se battant comme une guerre. Et nous le savons déjà. Emily, ni doi. Watashi tachi wa mina, sono drama kara hanarete, soko kara saki ni susunu hitsuyo ga arimasu. Ken Ward to Rowlen no kousai ga Bans Production niyotte bakuro sareta koto de, moto no creator no zai san wa hakai sarete wa narazu. 2022-2023 シーズンを 2021-2022 年よりも良い年にしましょう Um, do you guys know what they're saying? Emily said, this is happening because the members of the Beyond community have been so toxic for the past two to three years and it is spiraling out of control for everyone fighting like a war and we already know that And Giffany said, agreed with Emily We all need to stay away from that drama and move on from it. With Kenward and Lauren's dating exposed by Vance Productions, the original creator's property must not be destroyed in the future. Let's make the 2022-2023 season year the better one than 2021-2022. That is really good French and Japanese speech speaking Giffany and Emily. But anyways, that is all that we want to hear. We'll see you later you guys. Okay, thanks for your info you guys, and we'll see you later. Okay, bye, bye everyone. everyone. Farewell, Farewell, you, you guys. guys. Alright guys, looks like it's time to go to the parking lot. Oh, and good news, we're staying here at the Maples apartment. How's that sound? Sounds good to me. Of course. I would love to stay here. I'll go too. So I will. That's fine by me, even though I'm not the member of the Rainbow Maples gift, because I am the volunteer one. Now what are we waiting for? Let's go have some sex, and some fun. Okay Louisiana. We will. I bought every males and females condoms for us to enjoy. Now what are we waiting for? Let's go to the parking lot now. Guys, it looks like this is it. It's only us. Yeah, Lou. It is, Sully. I agree. Cool. Like, I don't see why not. Me too. Okay, let's do couples hugs and kisses. Although it didn't satisfy Gif, Gianna, and Emily. So let's go do it. Yeah! yeah. I love, I love you, my you, handsome my sweet sweetheart. sweetheart. I, I love, love you too, too my, my angelic, angelic babe. babe.
N, the Sarsect, has ended. Now, Summer has arrived back to normal just to have fun before. The name of the crew who I created, has couples, loveliness, and career. The crew's name was the Rainbow Maples. That's the name of itself.